Okay, so first I had to stop by Dollar General, Dollar Tree. I had to stop by Dollar Tree. I like Dollar Tree because I can go in, I can find a lot of stuff that I don't have to pay a lot for. And they'll generally have what you want and what you need. Now, this would cost, what, a good, I don't know, almost $10, $7, $8 in the store for one. And I can rack up on two. So my car key fob battery is dead. So I had to stop there. And listen, I know we always go to the dollar store and be like, I'm only here for this and that and da 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 da. And I usually do pretty good with that when I'm in other stores. But I saw this. I had to get it. All right. Okay. This is a good. I've had one before. They were for the shoes, and I couldn't pass up some old school lemon heads. Okay, these used to be my favorite candies, and y'all, I have been consuming way too much water because I always feel like my mouth and my throat is dry. These lemon heads will bring waterfalls to your jaws. <clears throat> you welcome. So now that I have a mouthful of <laughs> lemon hands let me see this is not the right section guys I have seen them off so no it doesn't even matter if you see more than one if you see one mom okay I know where to go you gotta get something for it and trust me Home Depot has it I am not about to let those moths generate and I mean it could come in a bag of flour it could come in something somebody else gave you it doesn't really have any distinction upon where it could come from but me seeing one is enough mothballs are no mothballs are no mothballs are a no those things are toxic Okay, and um, they put holes in your clothes, I believe, I heard somewhere. So, I don't know if I need to go online for these or what, because I've gotten the little sticky pads from here before. And I've also gotten them from Walmart, not Walmart, Amazon. And they work really, really well, but they're, it's more economical <laughs> to get them from here, aka it's a better price. But I don't see them. Oh, this is not good. I don't see them. I have to go and look online. But they are always a lot of guys at Home Depot. What? 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 Ooh, ooh. <laughs> what Be cute when you go. Be cute when you go. So we're getting closer. Flies. Bees and things. Wait, hold on. They make a trap to get rid of bees? Oh, no. That's not good. That's not good. I'm doing everything I can to attract bees. Bees go in and they can't get out. It should be a login step. It, it really should, you know. Well, they have fly pads, but... Ah, not exactly. So the moth pads that I'm looking for, they actually have like some kind of pheromone or something to attract the moths. Unless I'm overlooking it, I'm going to have to get an associate to help me. Okay, guys. So I didn't see exactly what I was looking for, what I got before. But I see that they have like this plug-in. You plug it in and, you know, they're going to come into the light. Caroline, come into the light. And then there's like a sticky thing on the back of it. Yeah, and then they're gonna get caught on to that. Okay, so this is 20 bucks for one trap, and then um, you get two glue cards, and then you can get the refills. But I'm gonna actually try this one, and they actually have some other similar ones, okay? Similar to that, but I'm actually gonna try this, okay? So this is somewhat similar to what I was looking for, but it specifically does not say moss. Okay. This one specifically says moss. However, either way, they say they don't have no chemicals, so it doesn't matter about the pheromones. They actually have a fruit fly trap, which is good. 
to know. I tr- how many of y'all try to make one? I tried to make one before and it didn't quite work out for me. So at least now I know that they have a food trap, but I'm gonna try. I'm going to try these because I can stick them pretty much anywhere. It has 16 traps and 8 steaks. And I'm going to see what happens. Um, and I'm also going to ask them about the ones that I'm looking for, which it would be something similar to this, but it would have like some type of pheromones or something on it that's supposed to attract the actual moths to them. And they were like a charm. I had an infestation before. I don't know like, if it was I went to the flea mart or it was some flower. I'm not sure what the culprit was, but I had an infestation before and it was hard. Okay. It was hard. I had to get rid of everything. And I also went to make sure that I do more of um, using the Mylar bags and, you know, canning and um, what's the, what you call it with the machine where you can seal, seal, seal your food up? Yeah. I mean, those things are nasty. They can even get inside of your jars. Don't ask me how. You're going to have to talk to the moss. But they're no joke. Okay? So, this is what we're going with. All right? And it is at eight ninety seven. So, here it is. It is super cold and windy out here. And I have on a mini skirt. It's kind of like a tennis skirt, circle skirt. And the wind is all over the place. So, I'm glad I'm done. And I can go home. <laughs> all right, y'all. Go over to HomeDepot.com. And they have a 40% off sale on uh, select items. Listen, use code bedroom 10, you get additional 10% off. Now, this sale ends on March 29th. You see what's flashing on the screen. There's some great deals going on over there. Go over there and check it out. Hurry up. And this super sale right here, oh, seven hours. You probably got like three hours now. 